Hello friends. I'm out on my walk with Hazel and Leo. We've stopped for a pause so I can start this, those cuties, my two rescue dogs from the shelter that they've just turned out wonderful. Here they come. They're always my little shadows. Well, how are you today? Um, have you taken your walk yet? If not, it's my friendly reminder uh, for you to put those shoes on, your jacket, your boots, your, your tennis shoes, and uh, the trainers, as they say overseas. Uh, here in the Midwest, we say tennis shoes that we just do. Some people call them sneakers, uh, but I hear in uh, overseas and maybe England, Europe, they might say trainers. What do you say in your part of the world? I'd love to know. <laughs> uh, anyway, so if you haven't taken your walk, come with me for a few minutes. It's a gorgeous day here in the Midwest, U.S. And uh, wow, I just really love this time of day. This is actually, I have dinner in the oven. Uh, and it's, you know, cooking for an hour. I've got some roasted chicken and some uh, vegetables and some mac and cheese. That is for my family of six. And uh, everybody likes that usually. Uh, and if they don't, they can make something else, but that's one of the favorites. Very simple, very easy and nourishing. Um, and well, mac and cheese, you know, but that's uh, my 17 year old who is a varsity soccer player. He'll eat more mac and cheese than the rest of us. So I have to make a lot. <laughs> um, one thing I was thinking of today, maybe to talk to you about is following your curiosity. Now, what does that sound like to you? Do you have something that you're curious about? Someplace you would like to travel or read about or a new recipe to try um, or gosh, it could be anything. And I guess that's what I'm doing here as I'm starting my YouTube channel. Um, it's been a really interesting week. I really in, have enjoyed it. I'm, I'm not giving myself any parameters, any, uh, I'm keeping it extremely simple, uh, uploading from my phone and um, no fancy editing yet, but you never know. I might be curious about learning how to do neat edits and who knows. Um, but uh, I think following our curiosity can be something like a guidepost to growth. Uh, I'm in midlife at 54. I've been a stay-at-home mom for uh, 24 years. Before that, I was a business owner and worked full-time for many years. After I uh, graduated college, and my husband too, he's pretty much the breadwinner of our family right now. Um, but um, I don't know what I'm gonna do. I'm, I'm wondering, do I want to go back to work full time? Do I wanna work part time and uh, try YouTube for part time work? And, or do I wanna try YouTube for full time? I really don't know, but starting this channel, I'm following my curiosity, seeing what's even possible. I have no idea when I throw out these topics or things that I talk about. Um, I'm not giving myself, you know, any straight, strict guidelines. I'm just thinking about things that I'm curious about or things that I know about that maybe you are curious about. So, um, you know, I would love to travel to Iceland someday. That's uh, maybe a dream. That sounds like a really interesting place, um, far north of where I live in the Midwestern United States. We're pretty landlocked around here. Luckily, um, the Great Lakes are not too far. Um, it's a few hours to drive to the Great Lakes, um, but to drive to the ocean from where I live, it's a 12 hour drive um, from the Midwest. Um, it's a pretty vast land I live in, and I always am um, curious and 
dream about the ocean. Uh, if we ever get to take a vacation, um, I, like to, I like us to visit the ocean or the Gulf of Mexico. Um, and it is far, we can drive if we um, need to, but we have flown as well. But Iceland is not as far as Europe, but they say it's a very European like country and it's all on a volcano and it's got some beautiful um, lagoons. I would love to swim in the blue lagoon with some healing waters and uh, see some northern lights. Um, that, that's something that really uh, sounds good to me. And um, so fo following my curiosity, maybe watching YouTube videos about Iceland. Uh, I, it's, just, it's at my fingertips. I can order a book or read a novel that's set in Iceland. That actually sounds really neat. Um, if you know of any novels set in Iceland, I don't, but who knows? <laughs> uh, so those are things that just are on my mind today. Uh, and then who knows, maybe someday I will be able to take a trip to Iceland with my husband and maybe my kids. We'll see. Or who knows uh, if there's uh, people that are interested in doing that. I could lead a retreat. Um, you never know where your curiosity is going to take you. And I would love for you to tell me one thing that you are interested in and that you're curious about. How does that sound? Let me know. And if you've made it this far, thank you so much. I appreciate your support. I appreciate your presence. Your presence is a gift. See you soon.